Welcome back. Well, she goes to Strawberry Crest High School, which sits right next to the strawberry fields of Dover and Plant City. So it's only fitting that she's now getting a national award for a project aimed at saving the very industry that her town depends on. Tampa Bay 20 reporter Mary O'Connell tonight with a local student now getting national recognition. Sit down with Tanishka Aglave for a few minutes and you'll quickly see her passion for the environment. Since a young age, I've actually grown up on a farm. It's that passion that helped drive innovation and now major recognition. I was in psychology class when I received the email for the award and then it said congratulations on the top line and I was really excited. The junior at Strawberry Crest High School named a national winner of the president's Environmental Youth Award by the EPA for her project, Reviving Citrus, Reviving Florida. My project was actually aimed to addressing the citrus greening disease, which is known as the most prominent threat to all citrus cultivars worldwide. And specifically in Florida, this disease is really prominent and it has almost devastated um, a lot of these Florida citrus groves and the farmers are really struggling. As part of her work, she developed a sustainable and eco-friendly treatment using curry leaf extract. I was able to use 3D printing to engineer modified trunk injection syringes where you can take the syringe and inject this extract into the trees and this was able to um, achieve a 65% reduction in the disease severity. On top of that, Aglave led a campaign that included planting more than 1,500 citrus trees, distributing disease management kits to farmers, and doing educational workshops. She was one of just a handful of winners this year, and the only one from Florida. I think that's really something that's important to, you know, draw attention and, you know, light to this problem that's really existed in Florida. And I think that going forward, this could really help a lot of Florida growers. Aglave tells me she wants to go into the biological sciences. And though she's just 16 years old, it's clear her future is bright. In Dover, Mary O'Connell, Tampa Bay 28.